The Exploded Factory wasn't the only PVDC producer, but it was one of very few globally certified to produce food and farmer-grade PVDC in large volumes for Western markets. A quiet collapse spreads worldwide. As the days rolled on, buyers across multiple industries started receiving vague delay emails. Production impacted by upstream supply constraints. Shipments were postponed. Materials were rationed. Some packaging manufacturers stopped taking new orders altogether. Others tried swapping in lower quality films, but quickly failed product safety tests. Within two weeks, an international yogurt brand saw its containers leaking. A frozen food supplier was forced to change packaging, shortening shelf life by 40%. A major pill manufacturer failed a blister seal integrity check and had to discard thousands of packs. The root cause, a thin layer of PVDC, is no longer available. The hidden supplier nobody saw coming. The factory was a black box supplier, a term used for manufacturers buried deep in the supply chain. They don't sell directly to big brands or appear on packaging, but they supply the suppliers. This one factory produced PVDC resin that was shipped to compounders, who turned it into film. That film went to packaging converters, who delivered it to food and pharma companies. Most global brands had no idea they were dependent on this one plant until it is gone. And once it was gone, the impact was brutal. Some suppliers couldn't fulfill existing contracts. 